What happens when your car breaks down on the side of the highway in Minecraft? Well, here we have a solution. This is the International Flatbed Rollback Tow Truck. You can put your car right on top of it. It can carry cars up to nine blocks long and uh, get you out of there. And also, I guess if you want to tow anything else like illegally parked cars, you can use this truck as well. Uh, the brand for this is like International. And uh, this is what it looks like with an actual car in the back. Uh, one of those compact Honda cars. I believe it's like a Honda Fit. But you can put like an SUV. It will barely fit uh, in there. And uh, yeah, it's actually a commission by Crafty Trains. So thanks to him for making this video possible. Let's get started. So first off, we would grab some materials. We'll take out another brick slab. Polish and sight slab. Black wool, black concrete, nether brick wall, polish, actually we already have that, polish andesite stairs, smooth quartz block and smooth quartz stairs. And I guess that is it for right now. So first off we'll add in nether brick slabs. We're gonna hover above the ground, make it two blocks wide and we're gonna make it nine blocks long. So one, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Actually, just nine. <laughs> I was going a bit overboard. All right, extend the rest across. Next, we'll go back in the front. We'll add in that polished intersite to the edges with a smooth quartz on top. Then behind here, we'll add in two black concretes, two blocks wide like that. And a black wall to the side, gonna be our wheel with another brick wall behind it. Do the same thing on the other side. Next we'll add in a polish and a sight slab here, and then polish and a sight stairs. Then we'll add in a polish and a sight slab, so skip a block here and add in three. And then the other side, we're gonna add in polish and a sight slab here, polish and a sight stairs on top. And then we'll add in another brick slab, skip a block, and then add in three polish and site slabs like that. All right, next up, we'll add in a smooth quartz block. So the good go right here, two blocks wide here. And then we're gonna add in four blocks wide on top. Add another one in the front sides. And the middle, we're gonna add in, I don't know, let's add in just two right here on top of the black concrete. Then on the side here, we'll add in another brick wall here with black concrete all the way across inside and two blocks wide. So it's like a two by two black concrete. Then we'll go in the front, we'll add in a bedrock. Place that two blocks wide for the grill, stone buttons to the sides for the headlights. And we'll also add it to the sides of the wheel. Next, we'll add in smooth quartz stairs to be facing outwards on the side of this and then two polished andesite slabs on top of this grill then we'll go um, right to the back of this we'll add in a birch trap door gonna open that up for both sides and then on top we're gonna add in um, yellow I mean orange carpet two blocks wide in the front and then wrap that around with white carpet the top of the roof of this. Next, we'll add in a dark oak sign to the side of the stairs. And then we'll add in a smooth quartz slab here. And then a smooth quartz stairs. It's going to be uh, facing towards the back, so it's going to be cornered like that. Other side, we'll do the same thing, so add in slab. And then a stairs facing the back. Next, we'll add in a uh, lever, a uh, blackstone button, and birch fence. So we'll add in a blackstone button towards the back of the cab, a lever, we have a birch fence on top. We'll do the same thing on the other side since it's very close together, sort of connected. Um, I mean, of course, if you built it like another place, it will not connect like that. Anyways, uh, next up, we'll add in to the back of this, two dark oak uh, fence gates. Then we'll add in a um, nether brick slab. We're gonna make it two blocks wide. And I would say one, two, 
four blocks long. So one, two, three, and then four. Add another pair of dark oak fence gates in the back. Open them up. Add chain blocks to the sides of it. Uh, both sides. Gonna be where you put the car wheel in. And then we'll add in a dark oak trap door right to the sides. Then we'll add in a uh, black wool for the wheel in the back. It's going to be right here and another brick wall behind it. Same thing on the other side. Then we'll put a gray banner right to the back and a stone button to the side of the wheel. Other side will do the same thing. All right, so next up, we'll add in um, another brick. Stairs are going to be upside down, facing each other in the back, right in the middle of this. And we'll add in another brick slab to sides of it. An oak, actually a birch sign, right here in the middle. And then uh, inside, there's going to be this polished black stone brick uh, block and then slab. So we're going to add in two slabs in the back here. And they're going to be brick for the rest of it, so all the way across the front. Then we're going to add in a nether brick stairs. Going to be upside down, facing the back. Right there, and this is just so it connects to the mud flat below. And the rest, we're going to add in nether brick slabs all the way across to the back of the cab. Okay, so after we've done that, we'll add in another brick wall, row of four here. And then the edges, we'll add in another brick fence on top. And then the middle is going to be chain blocks. Then on top, we're going to add in a row of four daylight detectors. And it's up to you if you actually want to like change the lights. Maybe it looks more interesting if you change it. Whatever, but in the original one, I just made it all the same color. Then we'll add in a dark oak fence gate here on the sides. Like that. Then we can add in this black carpet. It's going to go all across uh, the edge of it. So we'll, um, we're just going to skip that row in the back. We'll leave that alone because it kind of goes down a bit. So it should look like this. All right, so I'm going to take an inspection, see if we're all done here. I think we are pretty much done with this build. So, um, yeah, that's actually uh, pretty much it on how to build the international flatbed rollback tow truck in Minecraft. Hope you guys enjoy the video. Use this in your cities just to haul out cars, uh, towed cars. Um, but, yeah, and thanks again to Crafty Chance for commissioning the build and making this video possible. And I will see you guys in the next one. See you later.